Welcome to this video recommending some digital tools for creating 3D molecular structures. In this video we'll be looking at two specific software programs. The first is Avogadro and you can see an example visualization here for SO2. And the second is Molview and here you see an example visualization with CF4. I was certainly utilizing both of these tools as I was creating the polar or nonpolar series and in a lot of my other chemical visu visualizations. The first tool that we're going to discuss is Molview because it's simply a browser interface at molview.org, link in the description. It's very easy to use, you don't need to download anything, you just jump right in and create your structure with this drag and drop interface. And You can add or subtract electrons, move, change the affiliates on the end, change the atoms, create whatever structure you want and it will try to optimize the geometry as well as it can depending on how complex the structure is, etc. As it notes, the resolved 3D structure can sometimes be inaccurate, but that's really the case with any model. And oftentimes the structures are quite accurate. It generates this to the right, the 3D visualization, and you can scroll, rotate it to your heart's content, and once you feel satisfied, you can export it and utilize it within your slides or wherever you need such a vis visualization. Perhaps you're just looking at it for its aesthetic or perhaps in order to help you solve another problem irrespective of the visualization. The second tool is Avogadro as you can see on the screen. This is the version the original version, there's also a 2.0 version that I invite you to explore. And here you can see that it's a little bit more of a clumsy interface. You have to put in a lot more options and settings yourself, but it's not too much of a challenge. And as you can see, I'm currently creating this carbon structure. The carbon structure looks pretty off. It's as if someone drew it by hand, the lines are imperfect, they're kind of bent. Avogadro includes an extension called Optimize Geometry, which would be available under extensions in the top bar. And this will take it and then look at the structure and try to optimize its geometry. And then you can, through your pointer, rotate it, move the structure around, and there's a rotation speed where you can thereby set the structure to rotate. And when you combine this with a tool, for example, that will screenshot animated GIFs or with a screen recorder, you can create pretty powerful animations and visualizations right within Avogadro. So instead of just being limited and looking at one perspective for the molecule, you can have a 10 second or 20 second clip, depending on how fast you want to go, where you look at all aspects and sides of the molecule. And then of course, you can always stop rotating. If you ever need to make any edits, go back. If you ever want to add some extra molecules you can do that or if you know it's recommended to you need to in a sense make the more structure more complex whatever you need to do just add it on optimize the geometry and it will try and predict the best structure I will also put the link to Avogadro's website in the description Thank you for listening.